I'm Britt and I'm here at the Welcome Collection at an exhibition called Teeth, which sees dentistry through its history. Look away now if you're squeamish. For some people, having teeth that work is, is uh, really kind of important for, for their sense of self. The use of a, of, a, of a phantom head to operate on still is still a kind of core part of, of teaching dentistry. We've come to build ritual around that the taking of a wobbly tooth, the close inspection of it when it falls out. The exhibition follows a 300 year journey of the dentist profession from the streets and salons of 18th century Paris all the way through to the very different experience that we have in the era of digital dentistry and the dentist surgery today. We have always been concerned not only with the health of our teeth but also with the looks of our teeth and that comes across through the wide-ranging collections we have in the exhibition. It looks at some of the horrors of sort of pre-anesthesia of the, you know what people used to have to go through in the 17th century 18th century and actually until much more recently and it sort of follows that up into the 20th and 21st century and looks at the at kind of increased understanding of the importance of not just going to the dentist when you've got toothache but of actually looking after your teeth really carefully. There was an RAF corporal in the Second World War who was imprisoned in a Burmese prisoner of war camp and he wore acrylic dentures. The dentures were smashed by a prison guard and he would have been left without an easy way of eating his food. These aluminium dentures have been crafted from the metal of a fallen Japanese fighter plane. It's an extraordinary story of innovation and of just how fundamental our teeth are for us that that kind of, um, that kind of action was called for in those circumstances. We can't live without them. Access to, to dental health care has always been very much dependent on, on wealth and circumstance uh, and that continues to be the case today. Set against the backdrop of gleaming Hollywood smiles on the red carpet at Cannes, at the royal wedding. Today, this, this is still a story of stark divides. Your financial status is your biggest determinant of your dental health. I hope that, that it, people will leave not with this, just with the gruesome, but with some of the kind of lighter and more reassuring aspects of dentistry in the future it won't be such an invasive thing to have to go to the dentist that you know they can they can they can do incredibly sophisticated work without the patient having to suffer what a fascinating exhibition about teeth i'm just so glad that we don't have to see our barber if we have a problem anymore i'm brit thanks for watching